So over there is the Leaning Tower of Pizza. Like it's, it's kind of white-ish, so it kind of looks like an Alfredo pizza. At least it's not a pineapple. Leaning Tower of Pineapple Pizza. <laughs> Hello, my name is Weston Vrooman, and I'm going to take you with me on my trip to Europe. Is a Pisa, Florence, and Wayne. We are in the Pisa. We're doing a little walking tour. Then we're going to get some foodage and wineage and uh, free timeage and all the other edges that there are possibly to have. You know, nothing makes a trip better to Pisa than taking the classic Pisa picture. But I will say, you only need 15 minutes there because, because you're only there to take the photo. Well, here's one thing I did take away from my awesome tour, from our tour guide. She was very adamant about this, is that it is not the Leaning Tower of Pisa. Everyone's wrong. Everyone in the entire world is wrong. It is, in fact, the Leaning Bell Tower of Pisa. And that, I think, has a ring to it. Saving Greece, saving Greece. Cold water. Hey, Mom, how do you say caramel in Italian? It's a cafe gelato in a pizza. It's a five out of five red wines. Then after everything in Pisa, it was time for our wine tasting in Tuscany. us in to this little vineyard in the middle of nowhere. The heat was intense, but we were ready to go because when it was wine tasting, everybody walked everywhere in Pisa, so we were kind of tired, you know, and you know, they told us a little bit about their grapes, they told us a little bit about their olive oil, how they made it, all that. We got that information out of the way first, and then they sat us down. They brought us food, they brought us bruschetta, they brought us the bread, the sun-dried tomatoes, oh my god goodness, the olive oil to mix in with that. You got to build it, eat it. They brought us the meats to go with it. They fed us and then they brought us the wine. They said usually at a wine tasting, you want to, you know, you want to pour a little bit, taste it, see if you like it. And then later after you've tasted all of them, you can pour your own glass. But no one did that. Wine tasting was a success. Properly I've schlagered. Had so much fun. <laughs> I've had a lot of wine and I'm really happy. I was thinking to myself on the bus, I was like, no wonder this uh, tour gets such great reviews because by the end of it, everybody's very happy. Pisa, Florence. You know, Tuscany. Vroom and tested. Vroom and approved. See you guys next time. She keeps telling me she might throw up and we're on a bus with other people and uh, I'm kind of rooting for it.